Oh, you guys again. What's up here, everybody? Matt here, Rolling Navy Magazine. I'm here with Nicole. Say hi, Nicole. Hi. And we are putting this green Chevy back together after kind of fixing it up and kind of bringing it back to life. Uh, this thing's been pretty rough over the years. Uh, the guy we got it from, I mean, this thing was in the weeds, ready for the scrap pile. And it was just too good to let it go. So we went and drug it back. And as you guys have seen some stuff on this thing over and over and over. But now it's time to get this thing wrapped up. And that's what we're doing right now. So we're going to go ahead and get these seats built in, but we're going to show you guys where this thing come from to where it is now, so check it out. You want to get that back bolt, baby? Mm -hmm. Let me know when you're ready. Mm -hmm. Check it out. Okay. okay, guys, story time. So I got this van up here in Washington, up the street from my house. It was basically in someone's bushes in their front yard. Looked like it hadn't been cared for in years. As you can see, there's trash and drywall literally everywhere um i called matt and we decided to get this van we both saw the huge potential in it so i went ahead and pulled the trigger there were these random bench seats back here in the back these front seats i'll touch on in a second but clearly do not belong in this van if you know what kind of car they came out of comment and let us know but maybe at this point we don't even want to know <laughs> Um, as you can see, there was more drywall down here on the bottom. This was very fun to clean up, just in case you were wondering. The carpet that was in this was like house carpet. And you'll see at the very end uh, what was hiding underneath this carpet, which is kind of exciting and pretty neat, actually. Um, but yeah, lots of little things to clean up. These front seats. <laughs> oh, man. So they were cobbled in with some wood slabs and these long bolts, and they basically gave us hell to try to get out. And I will leave you with this before shot of the back of the van. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. So that's how it was. Pretty thrashed, huh? It's looking a lot better after what we've got done to it. We're going to go ahead and wrap up this side of the interior, and then we'll kind of give you a walk around on it and let you know how it goes. So here we go. you're ready to rock and roll baby yeah, which one you want to start? fucking dealer's choice lady ladies make it make it make it all right, let's do this back one. All right. you ready mm -hmm. so spin it for me. Uh -huh. ready for the thunder together as we're going to get it. 
runs, got brakes, got transmission. We're going to take it around the block and see what it does. We're going to come along for the ride. Here we go. So that's right around the block in the green Chevy. Oh, babe, you're the best. Thank you. So check it out. 76 Chevy Bowbill, 400 small block, turbo 400 trans, 12 bolt rear end, dual exhaust. It's like the Pontiac Grand Prix SJ of the early 70s, but in a van form. It leaks like a Harley. Got some work you have to do, but it's a good running driving project. Come on and check out what we did to it. As you guys saw before, the interior was completely thrashed in this thing and somebody had cobbled some really dumb stuff together. We got a set of the nice captain's chairs that can be redone really easily that we put in here with a set of swivel bases. Got a bench seat that matches the van somehow. Gauges work. I mean, it's got the tricolor shag up top. That actually looks like a hop cap to me, but eh, there's no way of telling. But anyway, so that's just kind of where it's come from to where it is now. All right, guys, here we go. 76 Chevy Beauville. This is a gentleman's muscle van, if you will. It's a 400 small block Beauville, pretty rad. Four barrel carb, quadrajet most likely. It's got a turbo 400, how do I know that? Well, if you know your transmission pans, the turbo 350's got the corner cut off a square. Turbo 400 looks like the state of Illinois, it's squashed. State of Illinois is down there, so it's a turbo 400 trans. It's got a 12 bolt out back. Dual exhaust, which is pretty rad. All pop outs on the sides, which is cool, and they all function just fine. We, uh, we got the swivel pedestals in here, so you can turn them around when you're camping or hanging out with your buds. Nice captain's chairs needed a little refinishing, but these are good solid van seats. They just need to be a little bit of love on them. It's got the factory AM radio in it, which is pretty rad. And then somebody put that up there. Uh, the carpeting is triple color shag, which is rad with the paneling. We got the benches in here. And check this out. Another thing that we kind of grabbed for this thing that we didn't have time to get in, but we'll go with it. 
this thing did not have rear pop outs for some reason so we went ahead and got a set of pop outs with the weather strip and everything so these can go in whenever you want to get it and put it in there that's fine have at it they come with a van uh all in all really good high option van it is a good running project for somebody we are fine we're just going to get this thing out there and let it go so this is uh some sort of trailer or anything i didn't mess with it it's fine whatever Cigarette lighter works. Uh, tilt column with cruise, which is cool. The cruise buttons both sides, but all the cruise stuff is there, so you can replace that pretty easy. But yeah, this is it, man. Pretty cool little van. If you wanted, it can be yours. Just follow the link and go check it out or get a hold of us, and we'll let you know what's up. Well, we appreciate you guys watching the video. That was a couple days ago. We had to break everything, go to the good guys show on Puyallup at the state fairgrounds. And we listed this thing yesterday and well, it already sold. So unfortunately nobody can buy it cause it's already down the road. Tow truck's coming to pick it up here now. But we really appreciate you guys watching. If you can, please like, share and subscribe. It really helps us grow the channel. And thanks for everything guys. We'll see you on the next one. Later, bye. Da 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 da